send a verbal missive that only my beloved will comprehend. What are you doing? Stunk. I'm on a crusade of true love. Nothing will stand between me and Maximista's heart. What was what was that about? What? Uh, I just sent a missive to the fair one relaying the whereabouts of our rendezvous. You recited a poem? Yep. Yeah. Maximus and the Jackal share the deepest and most profound of connections. We, we've got to that place in our relationship now where we can communicate through verse and metaphor. She'll understand. Okay. Under the royal gaze? That's what... Wait, that's the king of the Autolos guy. Yeah. That billboard. It, it can be seen from Maximus' window. We've often joked about its garish commerciality. But as for getting this rooftop to be a scene worthy of Aphrodite, time is of the essence. So would you please uh, assist? Yeah, I, I'll help you, but you don't need all this stuff, Spinelli. Hasn't Stone Cold on more than one occasion set a rooftop scene for fair Samantha? And didn't that cause her to gaze on you with ardent affection? Good point. But it did start to rain. Was that ill-timed precipitation cause for dismay? No. Sam actually likes to rain. Admirable trait of Fair Samantha. Uh, but I fervently hope that precipitation does not intrude on this evening, for I must set a perfect scene so that my marriage proposal will be so heartfelt she'll have no choice but be thrilled to accept it. Don't hold quick, there's no time to tarry. Maximus might be on, on route to the rendezvous as we speak. Untangle! Stay, stay calm. It's easier said than done. I'm stymied by a Gordian knot of light. Okay, just, I'll do it. I'll just... Ah, ah, ah. Light. ah. Thank you. I'm now afraid to re rehearse for the evening. Re rehearse? Why don't you just let it happen? Well, it might be an effective method for you, but not for me. It could prove disastrous. All must be carefully planned. Okay. I have to be the image of brooding romance when Max Misa arrives. She will say my name, Spinelli. I will turn and lock eyes with my beloved. And then I will utter the words, you are the lyrics to the song that plays in my heart. I thought you wanted this to, to hurry up. You want, you want to... Right, right. Ah, uh, we will enjoy a light repast, sip wine. Music will waft soft through the night air. I will then gaze into Maximista's luminous eyes, get down on one knee, and... I didn't procure a ring for the engagement. Oh, my God. A stone worthy of my beloved must be purchased and purchased hastily, and, and then the furniture's not set up. Please, Stone Cold, I trust your judgment. Just, just go and, and, and just see whatever that looks the sparkly. No, I... no, no. This is your proposal. You need to get the rain. Just let me take care of the furniture. Right. You're right as usual. Thank you. Yeah, I'll... Hey. What do you think? It's beautiful. Well done. Thank you so much, Stone Cold. You're sure about this? It's not too fast? Okay. This is your night. Enjoy it. Is there anything else I can do to help you? Actually, it's it's probably best if I'm solitary when she arrives. Okay. Stone Cold? I don't know. Maybe you could stay in the vicinity. I just... In case the night goes horribly awry, I could really use your counsel and support. Spinelli, you got this. You don't you don't need me. Yeah, but um I am sadly transfixed by raw and primal fear at this moment. You'll be inspired. When you see Maxie, just like you were Jake's what you're saying to her. Excellent observation. Max Mista is my muse. Words and actions will come when I see her. Good luck. Stone Cold? Yeah. She'll come, right? 
I'm sorry, that's needless conjecture. Pay no heed. 